Everybody has their idea of comfort food, and when you can't satisfy that craving, well, that's a problem. And that is why a Denver icon is making a comeback. Don't let the crowds inside this restaurant fool you. Zadie's isn't open, not officially, not until Tuesday. My grandfather, may he rest in peace, he always started projects and things on Tuesday. In the Jewish religion, for something, some way, Tuesday was a lucky day. Still, word's been getting out that Zadie's is back, family recipes and all, and Gerard Rudofsky, once again, is the man behind the meals. It is comfort food. It, it, uh, it makes people feel good. It's not fancy, but it's good and healthy and, well, not always healthy, but, <laughs> you know, pastrami and stuff like that. Zadie's has been a Denver fixture and a gathering place for Denver's Jewish community for 35 years. And people mourned when it closed its Cherry Creek location last year. Parking was a huge issue. And then COVID, and you know, and he's a senior member of our community, so he's not gonna, it was hard for him to pivot, take out online, you know, just wasn't gonna happen. The thought of no latkes or bagels or Zadie's desserts gone forever, just got to be too much. There's just too many people that count on it and that for whom this is a huge part of their lives. I mean, we have people, two and three generations, who ce celebrated all their family holidays, family life events. We call them simchas, which is bar mitzvahs, weddings, Shabbat dinners. And that's when Beth, Gerard, and Max and Joel Apple came up with this new location. And in a matter of months, the sizzling sounds and the mouthwatering smells of Jewish comfort food were back. You know, just carrying on the traditions. You know, if we don't do it, our ki it's gone and our kids won't. So they won't know what to do. Everybody's moving so fast now. They're, they're, I think they're nostalgic for what was in the past. When we closed, um, I didn't know that it would ever continue. And not that I need a legacy or anything, but it was nice that people thought it should continue. And I'm very grateful that it is. And Zadie's will officially open to the public on Tuesday at 9.30 a.m. at their new location on the corner of Leedsdale and Holly. And everyone is welcome. <laughs>